Hello my olives, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another curly video. I'm so excited to be working with Wee Dad on this video. Today I'm taking you through a wash and style routine to get frizz free curls with the Wee Dad Advanced Climate Control range. I'll be taking you step by step with these products. I've got the defrizzing shampoo and conditioner, the detangling spray, and the amazing heat and humidity gel. I have done a review on these products in the past, so I'll leave the link down below. But in this video, I'll be trying out the special technique called the Rake and Shake technique that Wee Dad introduced to me, and I tried it out today. These are the results, and I am so happy. This whole routine is a game changer. These products are next level. If your curls struggle with humidity and frizz, you need to try out this routine and these products. So if you want to know how to get these luscious, juicy, defined curls with no frizz, then keep watching. Let's do it! So first, we need to cleanse the scalp using the Advanced Climate Control Defrizzing Shampoo. All these products from this range harness silk-derived anti-frizz nanotechnology to lock in moisture. This is a sulfate-free shampoo and the trick to minimizing frizz is to be super gentle in your application. Don't rub at your scalp too roughly, you want to be gentle with your hair to prevent any harsh friction and to reduce frizz. Rinse that out and then move on to the conditioner. So you want to apply this just off of your scalp and all the way to the ends of your hair. Then use a detangling brush or a wide tooth comb to spread the conditioner evenly and get rid of any big knots. Leave this on for three minutes and then rinse. Make sure to squeeze any excess water out of your hair before you leave the shower. And then I just dabbed my hair with a microfiber towel to get any of that excess water out. After shampooing and conditioning, I'm going in with a detangling heat spray. I divided my hair into layers when applying this as I do have thick hair and I wanted it to reach each layer of my curls. Then I used a wide tooth comb again to detangle and spread the conditioner out. I always finish my wash routines with a gel and this is my favorite product out of the range. I love this gel, so you want to split your hair into layers again and use around the size of a 5 cent piece of gel on each section. You want to run your fingertips from root to end, then rake your fingers through the section and shake, shake, shake. This will encourage the curls to bounce back into place and you can also scrunch up your curls after to give it that extra bounce. Since it was a cold day, I chose to diffuse my hair rather than air dry. I switched between medium heat and cool air. You want to start off by smoothing the diffuser along your hair from roots to ends. This will set the curls in place. And once you've done that a few times, you want to take the diffuser to the bottom of your hair and point it upwards to encourage those curls to bounce back and to form nice and tight. Continue this until your hair is dry. Once your hair is dry, you can shake those curls out so that they become a bit more relaxed and fuller. And there you go, that's how you achieve nicely defined frizz-free curls. The gel doesn't make them crunchy at all and my hair felt so soft and it was so shiny. The gel leaves a really nice top coat and I feel like this is going to make the curls last for days which is what we want as a busy Kelly girl. It's all defined in each layer. I think going through each layer is a really great tip in applying gels and products. If you guys are going to try out Wee Dad and the Rake and Shake technique let me know or if you already have let me know. I'm genuinely so happy with the results. I feel like these curls are going to last for days which is good because I'm super busy right now with uni and work. I hate having to spend like 30 minutes trying to refresh my curls in the morning so I'm so excited. I love these 
these results. If you guys like this video, make sure to like it and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for your support, it means the world. I'll see you in my next video, guys. Thanks for watching.